cyclic codes part one general description generator polynomial and part two encoding and decoding an nk a linear code is called a cyclic code if a cyclic shift of any code word is also a code word the shift may be leftwards or rightwards by any number of bits consider humming code 74 defined by the parity check matrix very well known I consider a code word which is presented here it's cyclic cyclic shift rightwards by one bit gives this word which is not a code word uh, its syndrome is different than zero then this code humming code 74 is not a cyclic code uh, consider the other 74 code obtained from the humming code by permutation of columns such that the systematic code is obtained which means that information bits are at the left and parity check bits are at the right. Uh, this code and the Hamming code are called the permutation equivalent codes. Okay, so we have this code of this uh, parity check matrix. And then uh, we will generate, using a parity check equations, all 16 code words. Please observe that this code is the systematic one. We have uh, four cycles. Uh, one are tri uh, this one is trivial. The second one is also trivial, and two other cycles. They give seven code words, as presented in this table. Then this code obtained from the Hamming code by permutation of columns, uh, giving the systematic code is the cyclic code. Polynomial a representation of words is often more suitable than description by means of a parity check matrix. Encoding and decoding rules can be then formulated by polynomial algebra. A code word, this is a binary description, can be represented by the following polynomial: w sub n, w sub n, w sub one, w sub one, x to the power n minus one. For example. This code word, uh, it is a binary description, can be expressed as the polynomial. A code word W13, uh, this is binary description and this is the polynomial description. Uh, consider non zero code word of uh, cyclic code having the smallest degree m of its polynomial. It means having the longest all zero sequence at first leftmost n minus m minus one bits. And this is a generator polynomial. This code word is the so called generator polynomial. For cyclic code 74, uh, this polynomial that we have considered, this polynomial is uh, x to the power of 3 plus x plus 1, which corresponds to the following uh, code word in uh, binary description. Then, each left cyclic shift of this, of this word is also a code word. Uh, these k code words consist the code base, rows of the generator matrix. This is generator polynomial uh, at the left, this is generator polynomial at the right, and all zeros are uh, here, all zeros are at the bottom row. For this code, we have then the following generator matrix. This is generator polynomial shifted to the right, then one bit to the left, two bits and three bits to the left. Uh, this uh, generator matrix produces the non-systematic code, obviously. Then, other code words except all zero words are modular two sums of code base words it is very well known property of uh, of linear codes uh, described by the generator by the um, generator matrix then we will obtain remaining 15 code words 
of this code. Then let me repeat. Uh, cyclic code can be described by uh, a generator polynomial. Generator polynomial it is a, a code word of a cyclic code having the smallest degree m of its of its polynomial. Uh, in this table we have all 16, well 15 code words, 16th is all zero word. And uh, then uh, all code words we may say. Uh, except all zero work can be obtained by a multiplication of a generator polynomial by any non-zero word uh, and sub i let me denote of the length k uh, in the considered code we will obtain 15 words for example we will multiply g sub x by this uh, word of the length of 4 then we will obtain uh, this uh, code word which is a w a sub 10. Conclusion. Uh, product of an nk cyclic code, non-zero code but described by a polynomial of the smallest degree m, with every polynomial of the degree less than or equal k minus 1, produce the complete set of non-zero code words of non-systematic cyclic code. Such a polynomial is called a generator polynomial. It's been discussed on previous slides. Conclusion. Second conclusion. Any non-zero code word of cyclic code can be divided by the generator polynomial with the remainder equal to zero. If we divide um, a polynomial uh, corresponding to a code word by the uh, generator polynomial, then the remainder is, is zero. A uh, very important remark. Not every polynomial can be used to generate, uh, to generate a given nk cyclic code. Cyclic code generator polynomial is a factor of this polynomial. Uh, this is without any proof. Um, it is no time to discuss why it is so. So well, let me repeat. Cyclic code generator polynomial is a factor of, of, this, uh, of this polynomial. Then for n equals 7, we have three primary factors. 1, 2, 3. And two of them generate single error correcting cyclic code 7, 4. Code that we have already considered during this presentation and also other 7.4 cyclic code can be generated uh, and this generator polynomial is presented here. Part 2 Encoding and Decoding. Uh, 